diet have a big impact on your blood pressure. Salty and sugary foods, and foods high in saturated fats, can increase blood pressure. Avoiding them can help you get and maintain a healthy blood pressure. Looking for more tips on what to steer clear of? Start here. Chicken. We know, what could possibly be wrong with the staple of family dinners and lunchtime sandwiches across America. But chicken, even before you put anything on it, is often injected with seawater solutions during processing, making it a hidden source of sodium. In fact chicken sit 8th on the CDC's list of top 10 sources of sodium. 2. Pizza Just one slice of cheese and pepperoni pizza can contain more than half of your daily recommended dietary sodium. Even if you go for the veggie version, you are still knocking your blood pressure, for example one slice of Domino's deep dish veggie pizza contains 616 mg of sodium, while a slice of Pizza Hut Veggie Lover's Pan Pizza contains 512 mg, and also, who eats just one slice? 3. Alcohol An alcohol drink can raise your blood pressure slightly, but if you drink too much, your blood pressure may rise dramatically. For people who drink alcohol on a daily or semi-daily basis, Cutting back to recommended levels can lower blood pressure by about 4 mmHg. The AHA recommends that men drink no more than one or two drink a day and women drink no more than one drink a day. 4. Bread Yes, breads rank first as the food item that contribute the most sodium to American diet. According to AHA, for some perspective, just one slice, of Whole Foods organic 100% whole wheat sandwich bread, contains the sodium equivalent of 22 potato chips. When shopping, look for loaves with 5% daily value or less for sodium. A DV of 20% or more is high. 5. Sugar Here again, processed foods are the main offenders. We all know that sugar causes obesity, but it's also implicated in high blood pressure. It disrupts your metabolism, for example by causing your body to produce too much insulin and leptin, reducing sodium and water excretion by the kidneys and causing your blood vessels to constrict. 6. Salt The sodium contained in salt increase water retention, which in turn may raises your blood pressure. Reducing salt intake below the maximum daily recommended allowance of 6 grams, about a teaspoon, is one of the most important things you can do to keep your blood pressure down, especially if it's already hot. There are several ways you can do this, stop sprinkling salt on your food and adding it to cooking water. If necessary, Use things like herbs, spices, lemon juice, and vinegar to add piquancy. You will be surprised at how quickly your palate adjusts. No salt doesn't mean no taste. 7. Canned Foods Many canned vegetables, soups, and other food products are prepared with lots of salts for taste and to preserve the food. It is often advised to avoid these products if possible, and instead, eat fresh vegetables or low salt soups. If you do need to use canned vegetables, you can buy the no salt added kind or rinse the vegetables before eating to get rid of the extra salt. 8. Caffeine Coffee, tea, and energy drink often comes with caffeine which can cause your blood pressure to rise. For people with a healthy blood pressure, caffeine really isn't an issue, but if you have hypertension, it's recommended that you limit your caffeine intake and choose decaf, or half-caf, or caffeine-free teas instead. 
9. High Fat Foods While high fat foods may not directly raise your blood pressure, they can pose other problems, like raising your risk of cholesterol and type 2 diabetes. The mixture of hypertension, diabetes, and high cholesterol can dramatically increase your risk of heart problems. To correct this issue, following a healthy diet, such as the DASH diet, can really be helpful. 10. Potato Chips There is ton of evidence out there that high sodium intake is associated with a higher risk of developing high blood pressure. Potato chips are the ultimate, unhealthy, salty snacks, and if you find yourself eating potato chips regularly, you're going to end up setting yourself up for disaster. One study found a connection between eating potato chips and an increase in heart diseases. Thanks for watching, if this video was helpful to you, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and share. Till I come your way in the next video, I say, remain healthy.